In this video, we are going to discuss about the concepts of economic rent and transfer earnings for different degrees in price elasticity of supply. The first one would be for perfectly inelastic supply. So when the total supply of a factor is completely fixed or inelastic, no price is needed to be paid in order to induce it to be available for production. Land is the main example of the factor of production whose total supply is fixed and completely inelastic to the economy as a whole. This is because land is a free gift of nature and non-reproducible. The supply of land cannot be increased when the demand for it and hence the price for its user's price. On the contrary, even if the price of its use falls to zero, the total supply of land will remain unaffected. Land is there in any case and does not require to be paid any price in order to exist and become available for production. So to put in other words, the transfer earnings of land for the economy as a whole is actually zero. So transfer earning is the minimum amount that you need to pay in order to keep the factor of production available. So for land, it is actually zero because you don't need to pay anything for its existence. So the whole earnings of land are functionless surplus, that is whatever the price the land happens to earn is not required to be paid for it in order to keep it in existence or to make it available for to the society. So therefore, it is regarded that the whole price or earnings for land as economic rent. So you have economic rent is what is being paid for perfectly inelastic supply or land. So thus the term economic rent, which is in ordinary usage, means the price or payment for hiring land came to be used by economists as the title for the surplus earnings which the land receives. Since the whole price or payment made to land is surplus earnings in the sense defined earlier, therefore the rent as a price for the use of land and rent as surplus earnings of land have often been used interchangeably. Therefore, economic rent has also been defined as a payment for any factor, factor whose supply is perfectly inelastic. So any payment, any payment for any factor that is perfectly inelastic that is known as economic rent. Now put, to put it graphically, so this would be price quantity zero and this is the supply curve because it's perfectly inelastic. For any price change, the supply doesn't change, it is actually fixed. And this would be the demand curve and this is the price paid at this equilibrium. So any surplus that is being paid, so any payment that is being paid for land would be economic rent because you don't need to pay any minimum earnings, actually any minimum payment for it to be available for production.